So X-37 has been on orbit for well over 460 days. And since that time, Vandenberg has been on a 72-hour leash to be able to prepare and be able to land that at a moment's notice. So there's been an incredible amount of work across the range in terms of keeping the range instrumentation ready, the airfield prepared, uh, as well as having our entire team ready to respond at a moment's notice. It is uh, quite thrilling to be able to see that vehicle uh, at the very end. When you finally pick it up, it's uh, dropping like a rock. Comes down very quickly and does, does the final flare just before touching down, uh, traveling uh, in excess of uh, 200 miles an hour. A very small vehicle. You don't get a sense for how small it is uh, until you actually go out there on the airfield and see it. But uh, just an incredible feeling to be able to see that come in and, and realize the amount of work that has gone in to such a highly successful mission over the past 469 days. It uh, was just incredible to see Team Vandenberg come together not only over the past year but uh, over the past two weeks where we've been trying to bring the vehicle down uh, but due to uh, the weather uh, we've had to have the team on a very short uh, timeline to be able to uh, uh, respond. So when the weather was, was prepared, uh, we were ready to go. Uh, and we've had a, just a large amount of work that's gone into this. And uh, I was very proud to see uh, Team Vandenberg rise up and uh, support the homecoming of the X-37 orbital test vehicle.